right, today we're going to talk about free traffic. Why you want it and how to get it. Okay, everybody loves free traffic because it's free. My favorite part about free traffic is the way in which it converts. See, anytime you're, you're looking to, to gather free traffic, you know, not paid advertising, you're going after free traffic, uh, chances are that all the methods out there, at least most of the, most of the methods out there, are going to capture this traffic uh, when they're in essentially buy mode for your relevant offer. Now, now what I mean by that is, okay, if you're doing Google AdWords, okay, you're doing a pay-per-click uh, in the search results. Someone types in a search, so they're searching for the best coffee maker and their you know, search engine returns results and the top two or three or four uh, results are ads. Now you can put your advertisement right there and pay every time someone clicks on your ad. And, and that's when you're hitting people in, in the buy mode. So that's why it's a powerful ad. They, they, they are looking to buy a coffee maker. So present them with your coffee maker. The problem with that is, is because they're obviously in the buy mode, uh, you know, the cost per click can get really expensive. So the winner here is, is who can optimize you know their conversions the, the most or the best okay because you gotta you gotta play with your margins there so you know it's really super competitive and generally you need a lot of money to, to kind of test and and retest and the other side of that is Facebook advertising now Facebook advertising is really cheap you can get a lot of views for, for, for really insanely cheap you can even get clicks for cheap now the problem with that though is is you have to sell someone on Facebook okay they're you know retargeting I don't want to get into that right now but if you're running just an ad on Facebook your first ad okay they are not necessarily looking for what you have to offer so you really it's more of a sales process so you know while it's great and it works extremely well for in, in a lot of instances you know you're not targeting warm or hot buyers free traffic when you gather free traffic, when you drive free traffic, the ways you drive free traffic to your site or to your store, you're finding them while they're searching, while they're in the buy mode. So it converts. I mean, it converts way better than Facebook traffic, and it's obviously way cheaper than Google AdWords. So what we're going to talk about today specifically, because uh, we've been talking a lot about it lately, is how to drive free traffic to your Shopify store. Okay, this will work for anything. If you have a blog or a website or a business, it doesn't matter. It'll work for everything. It's the same concept. But what we're going to do is we're going to relate this specifically to driving free traffic to your Shopify store. Now, the, the first place I want to talk about, if you follow the channel, uh, you've probably heard me talk about this before. If you haven't followed the channel yet, what's wrong with you? <laughs> I'm just kidding. Um, but please, you know, subscribe. I, I give out great information here. Uh, people seem to be pretty pleased overall with the with the quality of information that I give out here. And of course, as always, um, you know, as you're watching this video, I always put super helpful links uh, down down below for you, uh, kind of related to to the topic at hand. So if you're you know have a Shopify store, or if you're thinking about uh, you're starting a Shopify store, or if you have a blog, or or for some reason you're online and you need free traffic. Um, you know, go ahead and check out some of the helpful links below you know, after the video here. But let's get back to the to the topic at hand here. One of my free favorite, just absolutely favorite ways to get free traffic right now is Quora. And you know, this is my Quora profile. Okay, now I haven't been on Quora too long. It's been around for a little while, but it's starting to really gain popularity right now. I don't know if exactly, but I've probably been down here less than six months. Okay, and remember, you know, even though I've been an online marketer for you know what, four and a half years now, it doesn't matter because Quora I came to it brand new, so I had no competitive advantage over you know than you would if you started on on Quora today. So once again, what we're looking at here is in less than six months. Uh, I have over 284,000 views, so this gets a lot of eyeballs to it. And what it is, it's a question and answer site. It's kind of the newer version of the old Yahoo Answers. Uh, the great thing about it is you can you can place links back to your Shopify store 